Hey guys, um, I wanted to say a few things about the late, great Marlo Henderson. Um, I had the honor of knowing him and playing with him um, probably in 2014, all through 2015, um, before he moved out to the desert. Um, I had a band with Bobby Watson, uh, the great bass player from Rufus and Max Ann Lewis on vocals. We had a band called The Cookies. And if you look up on uh, YouTube, you can still find some clips of that band with Marlo. Um, Marlo used to come and sit in with us every Monday. I don't think Bobby was actually paying him any money. I think he just enjoyed the hang and the, um, and the music. And what I remember most about Marlo is during um, the breaks, we would sit outside and smoke cigarettes. I remember he like clove cigarettes, I think, and I would roll my own cigarettes and we would just talk. But we would talk mostly just, um, you know, about life, about relationships or, you know, um, of course, guitars. But we would just talk that stuff. He never talked about himself. And that's what I remember most about Marlo. He was so unassuming when he had every, such a law, he was so prolific and had done so many great things musically. And I was just naive and ignorant and had no idea who I was sitting next to. Um, until later. So that's what I remember about Marlo, is how great he was, how, you know, he came in and sat in with us with no rehearsals, and it would sound like he had been, he was one of us, you know, he just knew exactly what parts to play, when to play them, what sounds to get, and, uh, and he was, more than anything, he was a great guy. I just found an old uh, Facebook message from him where he wrote me, um, I guess a few months before he passed, where he wrote, he says, Alan, keep that pop in your collar. I guess what he meant by that was, um, you know, keep a positive attitude. Because he sure had one. He had a positive attitude. That's, um, you know, that's, he was a great musician, no doubt. And he was even a better person, I think, you know. And that's what I remember most about Marlowe.